At a school as small as Sabine Pass, sometimes it's tough just to find enough athletes to make a team, but that is not the case with the Sabine Pass tennis team. Despite an enrollment of just 134, 17 students are part of the program with 13 making up the varsity squad. Out of those, 10 qualified for the 2A Region 4 tournament in Corpus Christi, and they were more than competitive. Sophomore Hazel Mystery finished third in the girls bracket to qualify as an alternate for state, while her big brother won the Region 4 title and will represent the Sharks in San Antonio. It's, I mean, it's exciting. It is certainly something that I've looked forward to for a long time. Um, and last year I had high hopes as well, but unfortunately COVID happened and I wasn't the only one affected by it. I was hardly affected by it, so at least there's that. But uh, it's going to be exciting. Last chance that I've ever got to, to represent Sabine at State and hopefully going to go there and make, make an impact on the draw. Ah, I mean, as a coach, that's just dream come true, to be honest. Uh, you know, there's so few players that advance to state out of our area um, and to get Travis, you know, winning first place at regionals and then Hazel, you know, having a great tournament and finishing third as alternate. Uh, I mean, as a coach, it's it's my wildest dreams, really, especially I've only been doing this for a couple of years. Uh, getting kids that far is, is really dream come true. I am so pumped. Like, even if I didn't get to make it a state, it's just a big accomplishment all in all. And I never thought I'd get this far, but I mean, I'm here. I've done it. And while Hazel will be cheering on her brother at state, don't let that fool you. These two are just as competitive as any other set of siblings. It gets pretty bad. At least I like think that whenever he beats me, I don't like to shake his hand because it's just like I don't like that idea that he won. But whenever I win, oh, I'm, I'm ready to shake his hand and I'm ready to rub it in his face. You got to love that rivalry there. The UIL tennis tournament is set for May 20th in San Antonio. Travis Mystery will meet Chilton's Lawrence Stock in the quarterfinals. Now, I also wanted to mention Deweyville's James Menard is headed to state as well. He faces Hunter Oliver out of Martin's Mill. I hope to catch up with Menard before he heads to the tournament. By the way, the players are on the opposite ends of the bracket, so they would both need two wins to meet each other for the state championship.